it was like there's this sort of daily ritual I had where I was like, okay, let's expose like five more percent of traffic into like the new data ingest system that like it has some scale issues that we're working through. And it would be like, okay, turn on 5% and then like stare at these graphs for like 30 minutes and see if anything goes up into the right really quick, up, like abruptly. And if so, then like roll it back. Um, but I, that was just like a, a, a ritual I had for a while of that was, you know, it was a little stressful, but it was also like uh, only, it would have been way, way worse if, if it weren't that. <laughs> yeah. Um, like, uh, I, like, a, I actually wrote a, like a talk about that and the, I compared it to like in, in this Bay area, there's like the San Francisco, Oakland Bay bridge and they replaced one of the spans like, like 10 years ago now. Yeah. Uh, and when they did that, they had to like, they built like a whole second bridge next to the, the bridge. And then they'd like close the bridge for like a long weekend and like reroute all the lanes between it. And if like anything was wrong, like it was just like, oh, this like crucial artery is just like out forever or not forever, but like for a significant amount of time. Uh, so the amount of like testing and stuff they had to do to get the confidence that that would work. I mean, it's a bridge. So like it's they, they were going to do it anyways, I guess. But uh, <laughs> it's, it's just like interesting to compare like how things operate in like real world infrastructure and software infrastructure. And like how much more uh, control you get, and how much faster you're, you're able to to move um, as a result. 